Hello and welcome back to a new video on Law and Hardy memorabilia and Charlie Chaplin collectibles. In this video I've got a whole load of signed items to show. Some, so I've got some more uh, original autographs uh, towards the autograph collection. Some are more rarer than others. Um, but starting off before I do that I'd just like to show this which I wanted to add in which are two stamps. And uh, I have to admit I've not seen these before. And this is a number 29 and 25. Uh, I believe they're from a set. So you've got um, Law and Hardy from the Music Box 1932. And then you've got the lost Law and Hardy film Hats Off. With Ollie sat on the same steps when Stan's hat and the washing machine behind him there. So uh, some uh, two really nice uh, rare stamps there. And uh, I'm guessing quite sought after. So it's great to have those. Okay, so moving on to the signed items. The first one, I have this one, which is signed by Anita Garvin, which is this lady here with Lauren Hardy. And this is from the uh, Lauren Hardy's Laughing Twenties, which is the Robert Youngson 1965 uh, film. And uh, basically, this is the original lobby card from 1965. And you can see Anita Garvin, she's just signed on this side here. It's slightly faded in a uh, black pen, but um, so basically she was an American stage performer and film actress. And uh, so, she's, so she was born in 1906, she died in 1994, she was 88. So Lauren Hardy films that she was in, she was in From Soup to Nuts, 1928. A Purple Moment, 1928, Be Big, 1931. Sailors Beware, 1927, Hats Off. 1927, Why Girls Love Sailors, 1927. She was also in A Chump at Oxford, 1940. Blotto, 1930. And Battle of Century, 1927. So there's a whole uh, series of Lauren Hardy films that she appeared in. So, and she was like one of the main Lauren Hardy female co stars. And then moving on to the next one, which is an original photograph of Rosina Lawrence where she's actually a little older there so this is taken in the 70s and uh, on the back of this photograph she's put a note and signed on the back and uh, this is 1972 she's put dear Jim thought you might like this more recent picture my heart Rosina Lawrence so it's a really nice note there with her signature also on the back, and we know that she was in Pick a Star 1990, uh, 1937 and also West 1937. So she's a British comedian, actress and singer, born 1912, died 1997, and she was 84. And uh, I think she was also in The Wrong Track 1936 with Charlie, uh, Charlie Chase. So uh, I'm just referring to my, my notes with uh, different co-stars and... Um, where they appeared with Lauren Hardy and, and in what films. So basically, uh, that's those two female co stars, and then you have uh, you have this one, um, this is uh, Best Wishes Dorothy Granger. Again, signed in a uh, light, I think that's like a more like a ballpoint pen. So you get to know the signatures as well, you know, you know if the authenticity as well. Uh, back in the times, you know, when pens were available and uh, with uh, fountain pens, etc. and how that changed. So that helps uh, the authenticity, which we know uh, they lived a little later as well. Uh, Dorothy was an American actress and she was born 1911, died 1995. And she was in Hogwarts, Hogwarts 1930. The Lauren Hardy murder case, which is this one, 1930, and in One Good Turn, 1931, which is also in The Chimp, 1932. And uh, as you can see, Lauren Hardy sat on the stairs there. That's Dorothy Granger right there, which is from the Lauren Hardy murder case, which is a very, very funny comedy short. And also in a larger photograph here, she sits in the middle. Of this portrait shot here with Lauren Hardy and all co stars for the Lauren Hardy murder case. So, um, again, great to have um, Dorothy Granger's autograph. 
All right, let's see uh, what else we got. We got uh, Jacqueline. So Jacqueline, which was the little girl, Eddie's baby, from Pack Up Your Troubles. And uh, uh, from 1932. So uh, again, she was a British-born American child actress, born 1928, died in 2002, age 73. So uh, I'm hoping I'm getting all the dates and the ages correct on these. But again, she's signed a... Uh, black pen there really nice shot with both Law and Hardy there in their military uniform um, and you have another female co-star this is uh, two Raymond Smith good luck Jacqueline White so another actress this is an actress from the later films and uh, she was in Air Raid Wardens, 1943, and born 1922, and she's age 99. Um, so again, another uh, great actress from the uh, later uh, war uh, films of Lauren Hardy. Um, I have this one, which again is a really nice one. Uh, this is. Uh, to my dear friend Elizabeth, may you always be happy, sincerely, Henry Armetta, 36, 1936. So a really nice original photograph there, signed by Henry Armetta. Now he was in The Devil's Brother, 1933, and he's an American actor, character actor, born 1888, died 1945, he was 57. Um, he played Matteo or Matteo in uh, The Devil's Brother, which uh, going back from memory now, I think he was the bartender guy in a, a few short clips with Lauren Hardy. Uh, but uh, another great uh, supporting actor in uh, another Lauren Hardy film. So this is what I like. I always like to get the connections. Anyone that signed. Uh, that's connected with Lauren Hardy, whether it's co-stars or just people that they worked or, or as friends, family. It's always good to have the extra um, connections towards Lauren Hardy for that. Uh, the next one is, this is a more of an ultra rare one. And uh, this is Charles Middleton. So Charles Middleton signed, there's a picture that this has come with Charles from another uh, uh, film that he obviously played, which I don't know too much about. But uh, Charles Middleton, he was famous for The Flying Deuces, 1939, and uh, The Fixer Uppers, 1935. So Flying Deuces, 1939, Fixer Uppers, 35, and Bohunks, 31. And he was also in Pack Up Your Trouble. So he was, he was more like a villain uh, in their films. Um, he didn't always come across as a nice guy in the Lauren Hardy films but uh, again another great supporting actor so he was born 1874 died 1949 he was 74 so his is quite a rare one he's sort of follows in the league like James Finlayson or um, uh, Mate Bush maybe so more of a very very rare Lauren Hardy co-stars and then the next one which was ultra ultra rare which you don't see many of his come along is uh, Walter Long uh, another great autograph and I think looking at that that's signed more in a pencil but it's still a really great example of his uh, signature so uh, he was an American act actor character actor born 1879 died 1952 he was 73 so he was in any old port which is a very famous one with him 1932, Live Ghost, 1934, Going Bye Bye, 1934, Pardon Us, 1931, and Pick a Star, 1937. So he's a very well known uh, character actor in a lot of early films and uh, as more of a villain. Um, uh, against the Lauren Hardy characters, which is uh, a great, great performances that he did in, in the Lauren Hardy films. Um, so I think that is it for all this video and um, uh, but that is it that's that that's the whole thing with collecting all the rare assigned items on uh, 
on Lauren Hardy, which is very, very difficult to come by now and to get hold of them. So uh, for me, it's nice to get hold of these extra ones that add to the collection. And uh, again, I will put them on as, as uh, photos as well. So uh, happy collecting, everyone. And bye for now.